Welcome to Mystic Realms Recap. Links are in the description below. Please show some love of the author and me. On to the show, congratulations, the purchase was successful. The gaming headset is expected to arrive in two hours. It worked. Seeing that the mobile phone account was deducted to only single-digit deposits, Luo Li heaved a sigh of relief, and Gao Xian's heart finally fell. He was reborn less than 10 minutes ago, after realizing his situation. Immediately opened the official website of Galaxy at the fastest speed in my life, and grabbed one of the first batch of game helmets before they were sold out. Even though this helmet, which costs as much as 200,000 Chinese dollars, has exhausted almost all of his savings, making him unable to even afford next month's rent. But it's all worth it. Galaxy is a virtual reality game based on the background of galaxies in the universe and planets with billions of civilizations. Its production and publisher is just an unknown small game company. Historically, in the early days of the game's release, there was little publicity and attention. All the discussion heat is limited to its small number of player groups. However, including the producer. Nobody knows. This game is actually a real universe, for years later, when the seventh version of the game is updated, all human beings will travel into that cosmic world. Among them, players who have played the game will merge with the game characters and obtain all the abilities and properties of the game characters. People who have never played games will appear on Novice Planet as indigenous civilians and become the lowest level of local residents. The original status, power and wealth on the Earth will be completely shattered and lose any meaning. It was a new era, a new era. Luo Li, in the previous life, did not have very good luck in that new era. Because the Galaxy game was too small in the early stage, it was not possible to enter the game in the first place. It was not until later that the game was updated to the fourth version, which set off a national upsurge. Only then did he follow the crowd and log into the game in the Internet Cafe Experience Hall, becoming an ordinary martial artist. Luo Li, who missed the excellent development period in the early stage and has no adventures. No matter how hard you try, the achievements are always mediocre. In the end, as a matter of course, under the invasion of the river system level civilization, he was powerless to resist and turned into dust along with the planet he lived on. It's really miserable, think back to the Tong Tian being that broke through the clouds and melted the mountains and cities before dying. Luo Li shook his head, still feeling a little palpitating. Fortunately, these have become the past. Now that he is reborn, everything will be rewritten. Taking advantage of the spare time before the delivery of the helmet, Luo Li went to the bathroom to take a shower and then made a full meal. When he finished taking care of his personal affairs, the doorbell rang just in time. Gaming helmet delivered. After the receipt was completed, Luo Li skillfully connected the gaming helmet to the power supply and waited for the self-inspection to complete. Then choose a good posture and put on the helmet with neat movements. It is worth mentioning that the game helmet has been put on sale in advance a month ago. Although Luo Li had very little left when he bought it, he almost couldn't buy it. But in fact, the time he entered the game was at most less than two hours away from the first batch of players who entered the game. Is a real wasteland player. Enter the game. Welcome to Galaxy, the unique identity is bound successfully. Please create a role. The creation of a character in Galaxy is the same as the selection of a profession. Once determined, it cannot be changed. Considering that players cannot register a second account, the decision at this moment will even affect their entire lives inside and outside the game in the future, or continue to choose the martial arts master from the previous life? Luo Li was a little hesitant. There are three types of professions that players can choose from in Galaxy. Superman, Martial Daoist and Mechanic. Power users pay attention to the cultivation of mental power and can cooperate with genetic modification to obtain abilities such as telekinetic power and cell regeneration. It's a bit like mages and priests in traditional online games. Martial Taoists pay attention to physical fitness and can control and strengthen various hot and cold weapons. The attack and defense are integrated, and the battery life is also quite good. 
Mechanics, on the other hand, are similar to craftsmen and summoners. You can make mechanical items by yourself, or you can control mechanical items to fight. In the experience posts summarized by later generations of players, martial Daoist is the most cost-effective profession, followed by Superman, and mechanic is the worst. Why mechanics are the worst, if nothing else? It burns too much money. Mechanical objects that can be manipulated by mechanics need to install special quantum communication devices. This device drains energy from mechanical items themselves, reducing their defense and durability. At the same time, the psionic energy possessed by the mechanic will constantly erode the manipulated mechanical items. In other words, the same firearm. In the hands of a martial artist, as long as there is enough ammunition, it can be used forever. Martial Daoist, with a higher level, you can even use your professional skills to enhance its power to be comparable to a rapid-fire cannon. In the hands of a mechanic, it can only be a one-time item. Maybe after a battle, the durability will return to zero, and it will be completely scrapped. Every battle is a waste of money for mechanics. And it is still the kind that is burned in batches with a flamethrower. If you are not a local tyrant among local tyrants, you can't afford it at all. No, you can't choose martial Daoist. Martial Daoists become more difficult to improve in the later stages. Unless they obtain the core source quality of the starry sky behemoth, the natural defects of human physique will keep him stuck in the B plus rank forever, and the chance of breakthrough is very slim. In the previous life, this would not be a problem for Luo Li at all. His life is not rich, and he wants to rely on games to earn money to support his life, so he can only choose martial arts. As for the upper limit of martial arts, in fact, Luo Li only managed to reach level 170C until he was dying. From the B-plus rank of level 240, there is still a long distance that may take a lifetime to cross. But now, now that he is reborn, the rank of B-plus will never be his end. Then, martial Daoist is not an option. It's not good for superpowers, too much emphasis on the cultivation of spiritual power makes his survivability weak. He can't tell when he will die after being slapped in the cold. It seems that the only choice is the mechanic. In addition to the label of a Krypton Gold Master, the mechanic who can control the number of mechanical creations has almost no upper limit, and the potential and combat effectiveness displayed are simply desperate. Under the absolute strength gap, the experience of previous martial arts masters is not of much value. Luo Li's eyes wandered for a moment, and gradually became firm. Galaxy looks like a game, but it is actually a real world. There is no such thing as career balance. If the goal is to become a great person at the top of the galaxy, then the mechanic is undoubtedly the only shortcut. Krypton Gold is Krypton Gold. Don't be afraid that you won't be able to make money if you live a new life. Create a character, Luo Li. Career Choice Mechanic, Career Choice Success it is detected that the player is carrying a mechanical heart, and a huge additional boost will be obtained. Welcome, Mechanic Luo Li. When the system's prompt sounded the last sentence, it was no longer an indifferent routine, but a soft voice. It is as if a lonely night watchman is welcoming a long-lost friend. Luo Li was slightly taken aback, and quickly opened his character panel, to check. I found that under the original novice panel, I don't know when there were a few extra lines of entries. Additional skills, mechanical heart, level, to advanced. Feature 1, all experience gained x 10 times. Feature 2, every time a mechanical item is manufactured, the quality will be randomly increased by 1 to 2 levels. Feature 3, upgradable. Remarks, your existence is an unparalleled miracle among mechanics. Taking a deep breath, Luo Li couldn't help but widen his eyes. He almost wondered if he was hallucinating. To advanced. This is a rating that has never been heard of even in the previous life, whether it is equipment, skills, or secret knowledge. As for the effects of subsidiary feature 1 and feature 2, leaking out is enough to drive countless players and aborigines crazy. Even Luo Li himself felt crazy. 10 times the experience. All power systems in Galaxy are built around experience points. 
character level, skill level, and item enhancement can only be improved by experience points. Even career advancement and special skills that emphasize epiphany and require a series of harsh tasks to obtain, as long as you are willing to spend enough experience points, you can directly omit the intermediate process and complete it immediately. It can be said that experience value is equal to power. Just this one alone, even with his eyes closed, Luo Li can become the number one player in making experience without thinking. And it's still the first person who can tie up and beat players from the second to the hundredth together. Compared with Feature 1, Feature 2 is even more exaggerated. According to the rules of the galaxy world. From the alloy arrows based on low-level civilizations to the huge interstellar fortresses of high-level civilizations. All weapons and equipment, as long as they come off the assembly line of the military factory, are all white and ordinary quality. The items and equipment usually made by experienced craftsmen or formal mechanics generally fall into this category. At most, the production is more precise and the durability is higher. Only after they are willing to invest a certain amount of personal experience points, supplemented by precious minerals as materials, will there be a small chance of producing green and rare quality equipment. As for the higher blue elite quality, it must be done by a master craftsman himself, and the cost is unimaginable for ordinary people. But experience points and rare minerals, where is it said that there are? Galaxy is a real world, not an ordinary online game where wild monsters can be refreshed infinitely. Every bit of its experience value has a well-documented source, and every piece of mineral has a real place of origin that can be traced back. Wanting to squander unscrupulously on item production can only be said to be delusional. Relying on massive resources and luck, slowly accumulating equipment of green and rare quality or higher in the long history is the mainstream of the entire galaxy world. Under such a background, Feature 2's ability to randomly increase the quality of items from Tier 1 to Tier 2 seems to be a hack. This means that Luo Li can produce green or even blue equipment in batches just like producing ordinary quality equipment without paying experience points and precious minerals. If you are willing to pay a little bit of the price equivalent to other people's production of green equipment, then it is not impossible to obtain purple hero equipment that only exists in Legends. Behind these price differences represent astronomical wealth. As long as enough time is given, Luo Li can even use this to buy hundreds of planets. The disadvantage of mechanics, burning a lot of money, is no longer a problem. This is really the achievement of dominating the entire server before entering the game. For a moment, Luo Li couldn't even imagine how far he would go in the future with such an advantage against the sky. Staring at the property panel for a while, Luo Li came back to his senses and chose to enter the game. Golden Eagle Federation, Odo City, Western Suburbs. Luo Li opened his eyes and found himself in a dilapidated private house. The initial identities given to players in Galaxy are all ordinary civilians whose property is close to negative. After players enter the game, if they cannot find a way to earn the first money as soon as possible, they will soon fall into a state of starvation within 24 hours. If you are unlucky, you may starve to death. Compared with other online games, it can be said that it faces a difficult mode at the beginning. There was no rush to go out. Luo Li rummaged around in the room for a while and found his own identification. Looking at the address shown above, Luo Li quickly combined it with the information in his memory. Odo City. Luckily, it happened to be the right place. Odo City is a medium-sized city with a permanent population of nearly half a million. It is located on the initial planet where the player landed, a big country in the north of Blue Star's third continent, and the border of the Golden Eagle Federation is near the sea. Past life belongs to one of the popular areas in the player forum. In the early stage of the game, several key plots that affected the historical process all took place in this currently inconspicuous city, but these have nothing to do with Luo Li for the time being. He is more concerned about how to upgrade himself quickly. There is no need to think about fighting. Below level 10, before changing to a formal professional, going to the wild is death. This is a very important message. In Luo Li's memory, the first batch of players who entered the game, because they knew nothing about the game, rushed into the wild without much preparation, 
wanting to fight monsters and upgrade like traditional online games. Then, of course, they were brutally slaughtered for a round by those unusually powerful mutant creatures in the wild. More than half of the players surrendered their first resurrection stone within two hours of entering the game. The price is very heavy. It is even more serious than everyone's imagination in this era. Because there is a limit to the number of resurrection of characters in Galaxy. Starting with character creation, players will only be gifted five non-tradable resurrection stones. Once the five resurrection stones are all consumed, the player will be completely deleted from the game account after dying again, and there will be no way to re-enter the game from then on. This kind of strict regulations, after being discovered by players, caused a huge upsurge of protests, and even made the game's reputation in the outside world fall to the bottom. As a result, half a year after the service was launched, the entire Galaxy Game Circle is still in the niche range. The overall number of players has always hovered within a million. And this is just the price in the game. In the future, when the world and the game merges with reality, all resurrection stones will still be valid. Those who did not enter the game, and those whose accounts were deleted after running out of resurrection stones, would have only one life like the local aborigines. Players will get the corresponding number of resurrections according to the number of resurrection stones in their hands. A resurrection stone is a chance to regain life after death in reality, at present, we can only find a way in life skills. In the galaxy, experience can be gained from fighting, training, exploring, learning, and making mechanical items. In the initial non-combat situation, making mechanical items is the best way to gain experience. Of course, there is a premise that you can't make equipment above the green rare quality. Otherwise, not only will you not earn experience, but you will have to post a large amount of experience in reverse. Thinking about this, Luoli opened his property panel again. The zero-level character attributes are all below 5, which is similar to ordinary local civilians in Blue Star. However, as a special group of players, there are still some preferential treatment. Depending on the occupation, everyone can obtain two initial skills of this occupation. Luo Li's two initial skills, one is mechanical affinity, which can increase the speed of assembling machinery by 5%. One is mechanical manipulation, which can remotely control mechanical items to participate in battles. Relying on these two skills alone, although the effect is not as good as that of a formal professional, but in the early stage of the game when players have not appeared on a large scale, it is still very promising to fool the interviewer and pretend to be a mechanic to get a job without worrying about the source of production materials. If I remember correctly, during this period of time, there happened to be a lot of trouble in a machinery manufacturing workshop in the south of Odo City. It should be easy to get in. As an individual, it is not a simple matter to gain experience and improve the character level through manufacturing. The source of the materials, and how the finished product will be sold need to be considered. Just talk about the source. In the Golden Eagle Federation, there is a certain limit on the materials that individuals can purchase through formal channels. For special personnel such as soldiers, state employees, high contribution citizens, or registered mercenaries, the quota is relatively loose. But if it's just an ordinary civilian with no background, then the share that can be purchased is pitifully small. Basically, it is only enough to make one or two pieces of the lowest level lightweight crossbow. If you want to get more raw materials, you have to hunt and collect them yourself, or you can only buy them at high prices on the black market. As for selling, it is even more troublesome. There is no need to think about regular stores, the supply channels, there are contracted by some famous craftsmen and mechanics. Players who are new to the game don't even think about squeezing in. If you want to dispose of your own output, you can only sell it slowly on the black market or dump it to some second-hand dealers at a loss. Back and forth, a lot of time wasted. Gained very little. Under such a background, joining a workshop and using other people's materials and channels to practice hands through the novice period is a very beneficial thing. And in Luo Li's memory, the machinery manufacturing workshop that caused trouble is the best target. It belongs to one of the large arms manufacturers of the Golden Eagle Federation, an industry under the Allerholz industry. 
Although the workshop itself is not well known, it doesn't look very conspicuous. But in fact, it is a supplier of standard equipment for the second-rate security forces in several large and medium-sized cities on the western border of the Federation. The daily consumption of raw materials and the production of mechanical items are extremely huge numbers. Putting it on a personal mechanic, it is almost equivalent to having unlimited materials to practice. As long as the physical energy can bear it and the ghost energy is sufficient, there will be no problem in making it without stopping from morning to night, and because the factory leaves the factory are all second-tier ordinary personal equipment, making it is not difficult. Even novice mechanic players can barely handle it. It can be called a holy place for gaining experience in the early stage of the game. That is to say, no one knows yet, otherwise the door of the workshop would have been trampled down by the players. As long as you get inside, you don't have to worry about it before level 10. But before you go, you need to get a piece of mechanical equipment to bring with you. Without that thing as proof, the appearance is no different from that of ordinary civilians. Even the gate of the machinery manufacturing workshop may not be able to pass through. After making up his mind, Luoli kept his ID card. He continued to rummage in the house and found a house lease contract as he wished. Look at the time above, there are still about half a month to expire. The initial capital is also available. Luoli is quite satisfied. Although the player's initial property is close to negative value, it is not really nothing. This unexpired rental contract, which has a one-third chance of appearing, is something that can be exchanged for some money. Although not much was exchanged, in the hands of Luoli, it was enough to be used as the first startup money for snowballing. Pushing open the door, Luoli came to the street. A lively atmosphere rushed over. The slum area in the western suburbs, where Luoli is located, is the place with the most chaotic law and order and the largest number of residents in Odo City. Almost half of the bottom level people in the city, as well as mercenaries who are not under the jurisdiction of the government, gather here. Luoli was walking along the street, looking through the low buildings along the road. He could vaguely see a few collapsed buildings in the distance. There is either a black market gangster or a monster that has not been wiped out. Blue Star is not a peaceful world. On this planet, human beings whose civilization has developed to a level that is almost the same as the real world are not the only overlord. The ancient creatures that have survived from the ancient centuries, the taboo monsters leaked from the laboratory, and the aliens that are suspected to come from the outer space and have terrible reproductive ability, compete fiercely with human beings for the living space all the time. Most human beings can only live in closed city circles, relying on the food output of agricultural buildings. In these city circles, the poorest areas with the weakest defenses often become the frontline battlefield for monsters to attack. Every day, a large number of poor people die due to monster attacks. According to the information in his memory, Luoli came to a waste treatment plant that occupies a large area. Take back the preface. In addition to regular stores and black markets, there is actually a third way to obtain raw materials for making mechanical items in cities. That is to search out the mechanical parts with a low damage rate in the discarded electronic waste pile and spend a small amount of money to repair and repair them so that they can be used as new raw materials. In fact, this is not much different from the process of going to the wild to collect supplies in an occupied city. But in terms of income, one is in the sky and the other is in the ground. Ignoring the vigilant-looking trash guys who feared that he would grab territory from them in the past, Luoli went straight to a dilapidated shop with no signboard. This is a unique waste collection station near the waste treatment plant, specially recycle any valuable things that the garbage guy digs out of the garbage, and then sell them to black workshops or people in need. He is a grey product dealer who walks between the underworld and legitimate businessmen. Luo Li, who has previous life experience, is not going to really go to the garbage dump by himself to search. Not to mention the efficiency, first of all he has to face the provocation and exclusion of the garbage guys who also rely on picking up garbage for a living. As for Luo Li, a zero-level character who is no different from ordinary people, whether he can beat it is still a question. In contrast, anyway, with some money on hand, it is not as convenient as direct acquisition. 
After all, Luoli just needs a piece of equipment that can prove his identity as a mechanic. Walking into the store, a lazy middle-aged man sat behind the counter and looked up at Luoli, then lowered his head and continued to look at the magazine in his hand. Luoli didn't take it seriously, and asked directly. I need an energy battery and a batch of ASTI small mechanical parts. Do you have any here? Hearing that there was a business coming, the middle-aged man reluctantly put down the magazine in his hand. But he still didn't stand up, just raised his hand and pointed to the shelf on one side. The ASTI parts are all over there, you can choose at will. The quality is not guaranteed, and the sale is non-refundable. The price of the energy battery is calculated separately, 100 golden eagle coins, can you check it yourself, no problem. Luoli nodded, not surprised by the shopkeeper's irresponsible words. I don't know how many hands have passed, and if the parts that have been scrapped are still responsible for after sales, then there is a real problem. Squatting by the shelf for a while, picking and picking, relying on the convenience of being a mechanic who can easily analyze the structure of parts, Luoli successfully gathered all the materials he needed. He pulled over a woven bag, poured all the needed parts into it, and lifted it to the counter. Including the energy battery, a total of 327 Golden Eagle coins. The middle-aged shopkeeper glanced at it and skillfully quoted the price. 300 yuan. I will use this rental contract to deduct. Luoli returned the price and handed over his rental contract. There was still half a month left in the contract, and the value was exactly 300 Golden Eagle coins. But the actual value is not so calculated, because there are always some black households in the slums who cannot rent houses through formal channels, and are willing to pay a higher price to obtain such a contract. For middle-aged shopkeepers who walk on the edge of the gray industry, this contract is equivalent to a bestseller that can be sold at any time. It's the house on Tylon Street. The middle-aged shopkeeper checked the contract with a happy expression on his face. He put it away, very simply. Make a deal, leave the scrapyard. Luoli randomly found an empty corner nearby, and started to assemble it on the spot. As a mechanic player, the two initial skills are not just the bonus assembly speed and the manipulation of machinery that are simply displayed on the data panel. When they are combined, there is also a default hidden effect. It can replace some simple processing workshops, so that mechanics can ignore the environment, without tools, and process some less complicated mechanical items by hand, while reducing part of the material consumption. This is also an important reason why a large number of low-level mechanics can still occupy a place in the factory in the era of the explosion of industrial assembly lines. The mechanical items that Luoli wants to make are not complicated. The prototype comes from one of the few basic blueprints that the system gives away for free after the player chooses the mechanic profession. Therefore, even if there is no hands-on experience in the past, it was quickly and successfully made. System prompt, you have successfully made a small drone. Experience value plus 3. System prompt, you have received the bonus of the mechanical heart effect, and the experience value obtained has been changed to plus 30. System prompt, you are affected by the effect of the mechanical heart, and the quality of the mechanical items produced will be randomly increased by one level. System prompt, your character level has been raised to level 2. It's so fast. Looking at the mechanical items he made, Luoli couldn't help taking a breath. Knowing it is one thing, actually experiencing it is another. To upgrade a character's level from level 1 to level 2, the required experience is 30 points. It doesn't seem like much, but without the bonus of the mechanical heart, at least 10 mechanical items need to be manufactured to meet the conditions. According to the memory of the previous life, it took about 18 hours for a mechanic player to reach level 2 the fastest. As for Luoli, it has only been 20 minutes since he entered the game. The gap between the two sides does not seem like they are playing the same game. Also, good luck! The effect of mechanical heart to improve the quality of items does not necessarily appear. In terms of probability, the success rate is the same as that of ordinary mechanics when they invest high costs and try to make rare equipment, which is around 10%. The difference is that with the addition of the mechanical heart, Luoli does not need to pay any rare minerals and experience points. 
Moreover, there is an extremely low chance that there will be a plus 2 level blue elite quality, casually throwing all the 5 points of free attributes gained from the upgrade on intelligence, Luo Li carefully inspected the drone in his hand, which was only the size of a basketball. At 003 Reconnaissance Small Drone Quality, Rare, Green Weapon, 5.6mm Caliber Single Shot Pistol The effective range is 200 meters. The load capacity is 15 rounds. Flight speed, 60 km per hour. Battery time, 2 hours. Range range, 10 km radius. Durability, 7 points. It is 3 times the ammunition capacity of ordinary small scout drones. It can be used as a temporary combat weapon, and its other attributes are almost doubled. It does not live up to its rare quality. For his first work, Luo Li is quite satisfied. With this drone, he is no longer an ordinary person at the mercy of others. Walking in the slums, even if you encounter monsters that sneak in by accident, you won't have no chance of escaping. With a durability of 7 points, it can be recharged 7 times. If used well, a total of 14 hours of flight time is enough for a long time. Durability, this is also the most helpless place for mechanics. No matter how high-quality mechanical equipment falls into the hands of a mechanic, it has to become a consumable with a usage time limit of hours. The profession of local tyrants is not something to brag about. A slight sound suddenly reached Luo Li's ears. Luo Li raised his head and found that at some point, a few thin trash guys surrounded him from the front and back. Looking at the way they held steel pipes and machetes, it was obvious that the visitors were not kind. We saw you coming out of the York store with your stuff. Put your stuff down and you can go. The leading trash guy had a fierce expression, with a hint of greed. Is this robbery? Luo Li asked. Nonsense. Hurry up and hand it over if you want to live. Seeing that Luo Li didn't show any threat, the trash guys approached a few more steps, ready to move. Yes? Luo Li let go of his hand and let the drone in his hand rise into the air. A black muzzle protruded from the bottom of the drone, slowly pointing at the leading garbage guy. Then, now it's me who robs you. After clapping their hands, Luo Li looked at the leading trash guy with casual eyes. The bodies of the trash guys surrounding Luo Li froze instantly, and they dared not move at all. The leading trash guy was also frightened for a moment, but soon, his eyes flashed ferociously. Raising the machete in his hand, he was about to slash. Don't be afraid, such a small drone can't carry Wu. Boom. Before the leading trash guy finished speaking, a burst of flames burst out from the drone's muzzle. A long and narrow bullet hit his forehead directly, abruptly interrupting his remaining words. System prompt. Killing ordinary life forms, you gain plus one experience points. System prompt, you have received the bonus of the mechanical heart effect, and the experience value obtained has been changed to plus ten. Instead of bothering with the leading trash guy who fell to the ground, Luoli turned to look at the rest of the people. What about you? Money or life? The trash guys swallowed one after another, and put down the weapons in their hands, tremblingly. Leaving the slums in the western suburbs, the surrounding environment immediately improved. With the money he snatched from the trash guys, Luo Li hailed a taxi and headed to the machinery manufacturing workshop in the southern industrial area. Are you a mechanic here to apply? The guard looked suspiciously at the young man in front of him. Yes. My name is Luo Li, and I'm a junior mechanic. Luo Li said without changing his face. Under his control, the rare quality reconnaissance drone showed full combat mode and landed beside him from mid-air. A dark stream of light bloomed around him. It's ghost energy. As a military factory security guard who has dealt with mechanics all year round, the guard quickly recognized that it was a unique ability of mechanics. His attitude relaxed, a smile appeared on his face, and he made a welcoming gesture. Okay then, welcome to join us. I'll take you to the personnel department to take part in the assessment. Okay. Luoli nodded friendly, put away the drone calmly, and put it in the backpack behind his back. As a rookie who is only at level 2, he is still a long way from being an official mechanic at level 10. 
The blessing of the drone for just a few seconds has already used up most of the psionic energy. If the time is longer, it will definitely be exposed. But Luo Li is not worried about being exposed. The assessment of the machinery manufacturing workshop is mainly to examine the manufacturing capabilities. In this respect, apart from the fact that the nether energy reserve is too low, and it takes a very long time to recover after making a mechanical item, there is not much difference from a formal mechanic in other places. As for the bonus of 10 times the experience of the heart of mechanics after officially joining the job, it won't take long for Luo Li to become a genuine junior mechanic. There is no need to be afraid of failing to complete the tasks assigned by the workshop. As expected by Luo Li, the joining process went very smoothly. Soon, Luo Li received his own exclusive workroom and dormitory. The mechanical manufacturing workshop gave Luo Li quite generous treatment. Both the workroom and the dormitory are independent luxury suites, and the daily necessities inside are all high-end products. Just calculating the value of these items is as high as hundreds of thousands of Golden Eagle coins. This amount of money, if placed in a slum, would be enough to form a mercenary team of a hundred people. Without staying in the dormitory for too long, Luo Li entered his workroom after getting the authority card. The tools and raw materials in the workshop are all available, and even the drawings required for production are completely stored in the tablet computer. As long as Luo Li wants to, he can start production anytime. These are all experiences. Luo Li's eyes swept across the shelves, and the rows of neatly stacked raw materials, in Luo Li's eyes, were big sums of experience that were about to be gained. Of course, there is money. The machinery manufacturing workshop calculates the prices of finished products and raw materials very precisely. For the average mechanic, the remuneration earned is not huge. However, it has almost no limit on the amount of raw materials, as many mechanical equipment can be produced, as many raw materials can be provided immediately. It is an ideal place for mechanics who are born as civilians and want to exercise their abilities, or for ordinary players who want to earn experience quickly and safely. But for Luo Li, it's more than that. With the addition of the mechanical heart feature too, this kind of unlimited production can also bring an unimaginable amount of rare and elite equipment. For this part, only the raw material price of a piece of common equipment needs to be added, and most of the remaining price difference, Luo Li can put it in his pocket. Exactly, as a special offering for officers. The workshop will also purchase high-quality standard equipment from mechanics at market prices. You don't even need to look for other sales channels. After thinking wildly for a moment, Luo Li didn't delay any longer. He walked to the production stage. First, enter several mechanical design drawings provided by the workshop for free into your own system, and then look at the manufacturing tasks. Pick the simplest one among them and started making it on the spot. Three minutes later, a brand new assault rifle of ordinary quality appeared on the workbench. System prompt, you have successfully manufactured an assault rifle, experience value plus two. System prompt, you have received the bonus of the mechanical heart effect, and the experience value obtained has been changed to plus 20. The effect of improving quality is not triggered. The original experience is only two points, which is lower than that of a drone. This should be a mechanical item that gives the least experience. Luo Li looked calm and was not disappointed by this. There is a sufficient supply of raw materials, and the experience of a single mechanical item has little effect. On the contrary, the consumption of psionic energy is a bit unexpected. Thinking of this, Luo Li glanced at the character data panel. The psionic value above has completely returned to zero after the assault rifle is manufactured. It seems that there is no way to continue in a short time. Sighed, resist the impatience that emerges from the bottom of my heart. Luo Li found a place to sit down and began to rest with his eyes closed. It takes a long time to recover psionic energy. At the current level of trainee mechanic, Luo Li's psionic energy can only recover a little every 10 minutes. And the psionic energy consumed to manufacture an assault rifle should be between 6 o'clock and 8 o'clock according to the calculation of this actual operation. It just happened to be stuck at the upper limit of 8 points of psionic energy for a level 2 character. 
This means that Luoli will have to wait at least an hour before continuing to manufacture the next piece of standard equipment. If there are no accidents, you should be able to upgrade to level 8 tomorrow night. At that time, the psionic energy recovered every night can be used until the daytime, so you don't have to worry about missing time and wasting it. The first stage of the novice period is completely completed. And before that, let's live with him for a day and a night. If you're enjoying my content, please consider donating a coffee or checking out my shirts on Tee Public. Time flies quickly in Luo Li's repetitive production. Before I knew it, it was the evening of the next day. System prompt, you have successfully manufactured a silver scale body armor, experience value, plus four. System prompt, you have received the bonus of the mechanical heart effect, and the experience value obtained has been changed to plus 40. System prompt, you are affected by the effect of the mechanical heart, and the quality of the mechanical items produced will be randomly increased by two levels. System prompt, your character level has been raised to level 8. Luo Li moved his stiff body a little bit, with an unconcealable excitement in his expression. Finally reached level 8, and a piece of blue elite equipment has also been released by the way. Elite level equipment is not easy to come by. Luo Li has been making equipment since yesterday afternoon, and now, five pieces of green rare equipment have been released. As for the elite equipment, it was just the one that came out just now. In the military system of the Golden Eagle Federation where Odo City is located, only middle and high-level school-level officers can buy a piece of elite equipment at their own expense. This is still a special benefit of the army. If it was a private mechanic, many even reached the level of a 40th-level high-level mechanic, but they still couldn't have a piece of their own elite equipment. Reaching out and gently touching the cold surface of the Inland body armor, an inexplicable sense of security arises spontaneously. As Inland series body armor. Quality, elite, blue. Defensive features, immunity to bullets, below energy level 10, partial immunity to fire and explosive damage. Close cover part. Durability, 25 points. Energy level is a unit of measurement for judging weapons and equipment in Blue Star World. Used in bullets, 10 energy level refers to the destructive power of a bullet with an initial velocity of 1 km per second. At this level, it has almost reached the ceiling of conventional firearms. The more powerful ones will rise to the conceptual weapons of the near future, the electromagnetic sniper rifle. Just the attribute of being immune to bullets below the energy level of 10, the Inland body armor is enough to be worthy of its elite quality. With Luo Li's current level, wearing it is like wearing an invincible vest. This piece of equipment must be kept. With it, some difficult plot missions, as well as wild forbidden areas, can be tried to break through. Resisting the heat in his heart, Luo Li made a decision without hesitation. Next, let's go offline and rest for a while. Since he was reborn yesterday and entered the game, Luo Li has stayed in the game for a day and a night, except for quitting once to deal with physical needs. The load on the body is already approaching the limit. After leaving the game, Luo Li went to the bathroom to wash up briefly. Then I ate a takeaway in a hurry, and then browsed the Galaxy game forum for a while before going to bed. As memory develops, Players in this period, except for Luo Li himself, have just reached level 2 at the highest level. Almost all the players who posted were complaining that the difficulty of the game was too high, and going to the wild would be death. There were even a few players who had been abused too badly, and angrily sent out posts about deleting their accounts and games. With the development of science and technology, Luo Li's era has already achieved technological breakthroughs in holographic games. On the surface, the game Galaxy has no special advantages compared with other games of the same era. There is no psychological burden for players to give up. The first person in the Galaxy game. If it is placed four years later, it will be equivalent to the existence of the leader of all mankind. Now, in the eyes of everyone, it doesn't matter if you know him or not, an ordinary player in an unpopular game. Looking at the so-called deserted popularity on the forum, and thinking about the grand occasion that will concern the fate of all mankind in the future, Luoli couldn't help feeling as if he was witnessing the changes of history. 
five hours of sleep, Luo Li climbed up with great perseverance, put on the helmet, and re-entered the game. Every minute and every second in Xinghe game is precious. As long as Luo Li guarantees that there will be no physical problems in the past few years, and when he merges with the game character four years later, all hidden dangers will be completely eliminated. The lifespan is as long as thousands of years. Of course, if you really want to live a thousand years later, you have to survive the battle of death and the future invasion from outside the river system. It depends on how fast Luo Li becomes stronger in the game. Entering the game, Luo Li directly appeared in his workshop. Looking at the replenished raw materials on the shelves, Luo Li took a deep breath. Continue to start a manufacturing process of brushing experience. Evening. Luo Li's character level has successfully reached level 10. The accumulated green rare quality equipment also reached double digits. It's just a pity that, apart from the elite body armor he got yesterday, Luo Li didn't produce a second piece of elite quality equipment. When the character level reaches level 10, you need to complete the job transfer task first and become an official junior mechanic before you can continue to upgrade. However, in order to trigger the job transfer task, a series of prerequisites need to be met first. The job transfer task does not appear immediately after reaching the level. It requires the player to learn all the basic knowledge related to the junior mechanic first. The main attribute of intelligence and the secondary attribute of endurance have reached the standard value. It will not be triggered until at least two or more mechanic skill levels reach level 3. It seems a bit cumbersome, but in fact this is already beyond the reach of countless aborigines, and it belongs to the exclusive treatment of players. Compared with the natives on the Blue Star, the promotion of the mechanic rank depends on years of training and comprehension. If a level is not handled properly, it may even be stuck for 10 or decades. Players only need to complete the job transfer task step by step, and they can be promoted smoothly. The difficulty level of the two sides, the gap is so big that it is almost desperate. Luoli was not in a hurry to trigger the job change task. With experience in his previous life, he knew that the difficulty of job transfer tasks was almost completely random. What you get is purely a matter of luck. There is an easy difficulty that can be passed by sending a letter, and there is also a hell difficulty that needs to kill the monsters in an entire fallen city before it can be considered complete. In order to ensure that the job transfer task is as accident-free as possible, Luoli plans to increase the combat power that can be improved first. Patiently continued to manufacture mechanical equipment for another day. Luo Li used the experience gained this day to upgrade his two initial skills to the current highest level. Mechanical Affinity, level LV5, increases assembly speed by 25%. It can analyze blueprints of all mechanical items below energy level 15. Mechanical Manipulation, level LV5, can remotely control mechanical items to participate in battle. The current control distance is 300 meters. With the mechanical affinity skill of level 5, as long as you get blueprints in the future, you can make most of the mainstream, personal individual equipment. Seeing that there were still a lot of unused experience points left, Luo Li's heart moved slightly. I thought of a piece of equipment that was quite powerful in the early stage. The overall rating of that piece of equipment is also below 10 energy level, and the blueprint can be bought directly in the market. Performance is comparable to a monster. With Luo Li's current ability, it can be produced completely, coupled with the blessing of his mechanical heart, if he invests at all costs, he may be able to upgrade the quality of that powerful equipment to the elite level, or even higher. At that time, his combat power will definitely undergo further transformation. There hasn't been any elite equipment in the past two days. Theoretically speaking, every subsequent production will have a high chance of a plus two quality improvement. This kind of adventure is worth a try. A decision was made, and Luo Li's actions became swift. He first handed over the ordinary quality equipment produced in the past few days to the machinery manufacturing workshop to fulfill the contract signed when he joined. Then, apart from keeping two pieces for their own use, they sold the remaining nine pieces of rare quality equipment to the workshop purchase department at market prices. 
After completing these two operations, Luo Li's status in the machinery manufacturing workshop has become an official employee. With the authority of regular employees, Luo Li can move freely inside and outside the workshop. At the same time, with this authority, he can also borrow all kinds of basic knowledge of mechanics from the workshop for free. It can just be used to meet the last precondition for triggering the job change task. Back at the workplace, Luo Li counted his belongings. Three rare pieces of equipment, a small scout drone, a tactical helmet, and an assault rifle. A piece of elite equipment, Yinlin body armor, two LV-5 initial skills. There is still a character level of level 10. This is my current strength. In the Galaxy game. Rare and elite gear. The bonus to combat power is terrible. In terms of combat power statistics alone, Luoli today is almost as good as his previous life, his level 20 martial Daoist panel. With this kind of strength, even if you venture into the black market, it is enough to trigger the plot. The powerful force made Luoli generate more ideas. In Luoli's mind, he recalled a rumor that once circulated in the player forum, in the middle of Iris Flower Street in the slum area of Odo City, near a small black market. There is a bookstore with a huge amount of knowledge about mechanics. In that bookstore, there are even extremely special mechanic skills and rare blueprints. Any player in the past only needs to complete a series of missions that are not too difficult to be eligible to purchase. But rumors are rumors. It was because that unknown bookstore was destroyed in a fire shortly after opening the server. Since then, no one can get the slightest benefit from it. Calculating the time, there are still a few days before the burning of the bookstore. Just to verify the authenticity. Just leave. After packing up his things, Luoli put on all the equipment and looked for it according to the map. The streets of the slums were as noisy and crowded as ever, but perhaps because of the intimidation caused by the equipment on Luoli, the flow of people crowding around him was much looser than when he first came. Occasionally, he passed by a mercenary with a gun on his back, and there was a little fear in the gaze of the other party. Dyer's bookstore should be here. Stopping at the door of a dilapidated and deserted bookstore, Luo Li looked up at the wooden signboard hanging on it. The signboard is made of wooden planks. There are some mottled textures and green moss on the edges. The name of the store in the middle is written crookedly, but it gives people a very cute feeling. It's as if the owner of the handwriting is a little girl who is still innocent. Stepping into the store, the light suddenly became dim. The humid and cold air in the room flooded into the lungs with the breath, making Luo Li feel a little uncomfortable. Terrible environment. Luo Li frowned, looked around, and took the structure of this small bookstore into his eyes. The entire bookstore has a small space and no customers. There are only two bookshelves under the walls on both sides of the door, and there are only a few dozen books and picture albums on them. The position facing the door is the darkest place in the entire store. A middle-aged woman who couldn't see her face was sitting silently behind the counter, her chin resting on one hand, and her eyes were unfocused on the bookshelf beside her. Is there a drawing of the light power arm here? Luo Li coughed twice, breaking the silence in the store. The drawing of the power arm? The middle-aged female shopkeeper seems to have not recovered. She was interrupted by Luo Li's voice, and she was dazed for a moment, before she could react. Yes. 15,000 golden eagle coins per piece, this price is obviously expensive. The raw materials of Luo Li's rare quality reconnaissance drone are only 300 golden eagle coins. Although those raw materials are all dug out from the garbage dump, the price has already been discounted countless times. But it can also be seen from the side how outrageous the asking price of 15,000 is. Let me see first. Luo Li didn't rush to say anything, but calmly put forward the request for inspection. The middle-aged female shopkeeper was quite surprised. Luo Li was also the first customer not to show anger after hearing her offer. She stood up silently, turned around and opened the safe behind the counter and carefully took out a yellow blueprint from inside. MS, Dyer's design drawing of the light power arm. After receiving the drawing, Luoli glanced over and noticed the two letters MS at the beginning. 
His pupils constricted slightly, and the shock in his heart could hardly be suppressed. Although Luo Li in his previous life didn't do very well, he somehow got into the seventh version of the game, the character who set foot on the starry sky. In terms of vision and knowledge, he is the best among all the people in the current Blue Star world. No one knows better than him how important the MS series is to mechanics. MS, the abbreviation of Universal Humanoid Mecha. A series of accessories related to it belong to the most advanced mechanical creations. On the entire Blue Star, only those who have reached the level 60 master domain and are at the top of the entire world will start to get involved in this domain. And in the history of the previous life, even at the end of the second version of the game, Blue Star survived the Doomsday Catastrophe, and the entire planet was integrated into the galaxy civilization world on the eve. There has never been a real humanoid mecha. That's the cutting edge of cutting edge technology, how can there be such a thing here? In just a few seconds, Luo Li's mood went from shock to disbelief. He continued to look down with solemn eyes, entered the line of parameters above into the system log, and then used the machine affinity skill to analyze. The green fluorescence representing the successful passing of the inspection was constantly refreshed in his field of vision without any mistakes. This drawing is real. The middle-aged female shopkeeper gave Luo Li only a quarter of the full version of the blueprint. With this part, the power arm cannot be made, but there is no problem in verifying the authenticity of the drawing. The price is very reasonable. I want this blueprint. Luo Li didn't bargain, and simply took out the money. For fear of saying one more thing, the cooked duck flew away. The design drawings of the MS series, no matter where they are, are rare treasures that can't be found. When you meet, you can buy it if you can, grab it if you can't buy it, go back to level up if you can't grab it, and continue to come and grab it when you can win. Anyway, as long as there is still a glimmer of hope, no matter what the price is, it is worth fighting for with all your strength. Are there any other drawings of the same type? Putting the blueprint of the light power arm into the backpack carefully, Luo Li asked, casually. The nine pieces of rare equipment sold at the market price to the machinery manufacturing workshop brought Luo Li an income of more than 60,000 Golden Eagle coins. He has enough confidence to ask such a question. There is also a drawing of the core processor. However, I don't want money for this one. The middle-aged female shopkeeper looked at the Inland body armor on Luo Li, as if judging his strength. After hesitating for a while, he expressed his intentions somewhat uncertainly. If you have the strength of a mid-level mechanic, I need you to do me a favor. At that time, the blueprint can be sent to you for free, really? Luo Li was slightly taken aback, looking at the middle-aged female shop owner with something wrong in his eyes. Where did this seemingly inconspicuous middle-aged woman find so many blueprints that can be called weapons of the country? It's okay to help. In this case, the promise must be promised. Even if the task is to wipe out the entire Golden Eagle Federation, and then turn the bones into ashes, it must first occupy the whole first. After thinking for a while, Luo Li carefully worded a patch for himself. However, my strength is only equivalent to that of a mechanic who has just been promoted to the middle level. If the difficulty is too high, it may take a while to prepare. What Luo Li said is not a lie. After he goes back today, he will definitely start making light power arms. And with the addition of this powerful piece of equipment, coupled with proper tactical planning, Luo Li's explosive fighting power was already comparable to that of a not-so-rich level 25 mid-level mechanic. If there is more time, let Luo Li complete the job transfer task of the junior mechanic first. Well, even the prefix, not very rich, can be removed. He is a genuine mid-level mechanic. As long as you are a mid-level mechanic. In this slum area, no one should be able to defeat a mid-level mechanic. Hearing Luo Li's reply, a hint of hope quietly appeared in the eyes of the middle-aged female shopkeeper. Okay, so what do you want me to do for you? I want you to kill the head of the Black Gold Society, the one-eyed Titan Dink. The middle-aged female shopkeeper said, revealing deep-seated hatred in her tone. He's a bloody trafficker. One-eyed Titan Dink? Luo Li didn't know anything about the name, but it doesn't matter, he looked down at his system log. 
As expected, the system triggered a temporary task. System prompt, you have triggered AC plus level task, revenge. Mission objective, kill the head of the black gold smuggling hall, Dink, who is entrenched near Tylon Street. Task time limit, to be determined. C plus level task? The system's rating of task difficulty is calculated based on the player's current strength. The difficulty of level C plus is equivalent to the strength of the task target, which is about the same as Luoli. The possibility of winning or losing in a frontal battle is equally divided. A task of this difficulty can actually reward a design blueprint of a humanoid mecha part. Luo Li's eyes widened slightly, as if he had picked up a huge sum of money, for nothing. According to the task description, it seems that the strength of the two sides is equal, and the outcome depends entirely on God's will. But Luo Li will hang up if he can't stand it. Luo Li has yet to get the light mechanical power arm and the job transfer task of the junior mechanic. This part of the combat power has not been included in the calculation by the system. This means that once Luo Li is fully ready, what awaits him is just a grown UPS on children's battle. It's hard to fail. Raising his head, Luo Li looked at the middle-aged female shopkeeper. I have accepted this task. Three days at the latest, I will find trouble with him. The time limit of three days is very delicate, it won't take too long to cause the task to change, and it will leave enough room for Luo Li to complete the job transfer task first. I'm waiting for your good news. The middle-aged female shopkeeper has no objection to this time. She relaxed, as if thinking of something, she said to Luo Li again. By the way, I still have some intermediate and advanced mechanical theory knowledge in my store. If you are interested, you can come and read it. I will give you free. Intermediate and high-level mechanical theory knowledge corresponds to the domain of intermediate and high-level mechanics. When Luo Li is promoted to a higher level in the future, he will not be able to avoid these pre-knowledges that trigger job transfer tasks. In most countries of Blue Star, these are already regulated content. Without certain authority and status, it is difficult to get in touch. Is there such a good thing? Luo Li suddenly remembered that the reason why Dyer's bookstore became a legend in the player forum was due to the advanced knowledge that was originally controlled. Then thank you in advance. I will come and have a look when I am free these two days. After bidding farewell to the middle-aged female shopkeeper, Luo Li went to the small black market to make big purchases. With a huge sum of more than 40,000 golden eagle coins in his pocket, Luo Li spent the money very happily. Had a good shopping addiction. However, he did not spend money indiscriminately, and purchased the necessary raw materials according to the requirements of the drawings. It is worth mentioning that even the ultra-high-end lightweight power arm of the MS type only needs some relatively common basic parts. Most have stricter requirements on quantity and size. Luo Li bought the whole set of parts without even spending the Golden Eagle coins equivalent to half the price of the drawing. In contrast, in order to improve the quality of the light power arm manufactured, the expensive minerals that play a catalytic role are purchased, but Luo Li paid a great price almost fell back into abject poverty. This is just a set of ores that have a one-tenth chance for ordinary mechanics to evolve the power arm from ordinary quality to green rare quality ore. No wonder there are so few rare equipment on the market. Having personally experienced the difficulties of an ordinary mechanic, Luo Li did not wander around anymore. He quickly drove back to his workshop. Place the materials for making the light power arm on the workbench in turn. Uneasy, Luo Li took out the blueprint again and carefully studied the steps above. In addition to browsing, because the time in the workshop is relatively rich, Luo Li has time to find out more information. Drawings are handwritten. Look at the handwriting is light and beautiful. It seems to be a gentle, intelligent, naughty and cunning girl, explaining her feelings in detail. Looking at these handwriting, Luo Li faintly felt a little familiar. He thought about it for a while, and then he noticed that these handwritings seemed to be written by the same person as the words on the signboard of the bookstore. The only difference is that one is written in childhood, and the other is like after growing up. Is the original author of this drawing named Dyer? Put away the drawings. Luo Li prayed silently for a while, before starting the production process. 
Invest 500 experience points to build a special manufacturing environment. Input K red stone to increase the melting point of the material. Put in silver zeolite to speed up the filtration of impurities. Put in xylan alloy. One by one precious minerals were methodically put in by Luo Li and constructed from experience points, suspended in the temporary red energy pool in midair. Every operation means burning hundreds to tens of thousands of golden eagle coins. After the 15-minute production reading article is over, gorgeous brilliance poured down from the formed robotic arm, like a river of stars flowing in the night sky. System prompt, you have successfully manufactured a MS-001 light mechanical power arm, experience value, plus 35. System prompt, you have received the bonus of the mechanical heart effect, and the experience value obtained has been changed to plus 350. System prompt, catalyzed by high-quality minerals, the quality of the mechanical power arm is sublimated to a rare, green, quality. System prompt, you are affected by the effect of the mechanical heart, and the quality of the mechanical items produced will be randomly increased by two levels. System prompt, the quality of the MS-001 light mechanical power arm has been upgraded from rare, green, to heroic, purple. The prompt sound of the system is like the sound of nature in the ears. Luoli exhaled softly, looking at the newly released equipment eagerly. Dale's light power arm, left. Quality, hero, purple. Attributes, strength plus 225, the part covered by the power arm, immune to any form of damage below the energy level of 50. Accessory skills, ultimate explosion, manipulate the power arm to hit the enemy at supersonic speed, damage, plus 25%. Cooldown time, 25 seconds. Durability, 2,500 points. Closing his eyes, Luo Li calmed down his emotions slowly. After a while, he opened his eyes again. The equipment details that come into view remain unchanged. This time, it is really better than the best situation imagined. Purple Hero Quality Just like its description, it belongs to the heroes who are at the top of the human elite, and only the top-level equipment is eligible to have. Since the Golden Eagle Federation has been recorded, it is the only one who holds hero-level equipment. It was their founding general 200 years ago. Mike Patrick, the death general who once led troops to destroy several small countries. And now, at this very moment. On this land of the Federation, Luo Li will become the second person to hold hero equipment since the founding of the Federation. Go forward and attach this piece of power arm to the left arm. The silver streamlined power arm is automatically fine-tuned, and it is tightly sewn together with the arm. Start up. Luo Li whispered an order. The power arm attached to his left arm trembled slightly, and a magnificent starburst, like a galaxy, emerged on the surface. Surging power, starting from the left arm, swept across Luo Li's whole body. At this moment, Luo Li felt as if he could knock down a building. This is not an illusion, but the real data transmitted to Luo Li by the power arm. Count the properties of this power arm. Strength, plus 225 points, which is equivalent to the basic strength attribute of a level 45 martial Daoist before gaining the professional bonus. With this terrifying power, it is easy to dismantle tanks and buildings with bare hands. Immune to all damage at the energy level of 50 means that the electromagnetic guns on the warship cannot penetrate the outer armor of the power arm. Of course, if an electromagnetic gun is actually shot, there is no need to destroy the power arm. Just the collision between it and the power arm can turn all of Luo Li's body into a cloud of blood except for his left arm. Incidental skills are unique symbols of hero-level equipment. It is equivalent to giving Luo Li an additional combat skill called Extreme Explosion. You know, Luo Li has only two initial skills up to now. Also, the last 2,500 points of durability. This blinding durability almost made Luo Li think that what he saw was a hallucination. With Luo Li's current combat intensity, relying on the durability of this value, he can even use the power arm until a year later turn consumables abruptly into permanent weapons. With this piece of equipment, I can pretend to be a martial Daoist. Moreover, I'm still a senior, middle-level martial Daoist. 
Luo Li made a judgment for himself. The novelty of acquiring hero equipment only lasted for a short time, with adapting to the strength brought by the new equipment. Taking advantage of the rest time, Luo Li borrowed all the basic knowledge of machinery from the machinery manufacturing workshop. As a mechanic, Luo Li's time to actually make mechanical items is actually very short. Most of the time, it is still spent waiting for its own psionic energy to recover. In the gap between psionic energy recovery, Luo Li can be used to read these basic knowledge and make up for the last shortcoming of triggering the pre-transfer task. If there is no accident, you can learn all the basic knowledge tomorrow night. At that time, the task of changing jobs should appear. For the upcoming job transfer task, Luo Li had some expectations. Since he entered the game, his first official battle may appear in that mission. 20 hours later. System prompt, all preconditions are met, triggering job transfer tasks. Professional transfer task, survive. Task difficulty, A+. Mission objective, escape from the industrial area of Odo City. Mission brief, a large number of industries under the Allerholz industry are about to be attacked by a mysterious organization. As a regular employee of the Orholz industry, please survive this attack. A plus grade difficulty? Luo Li's expression changed slightly. This kind of difficulty means that Luo Li's chances of winning are extremely low. Luo Li now has a piece of heroic equipment in his hands. The comprehensive combat power evaluation is comparable to some senior mid-level professionals. It might even be among the strongest in the entire Ajuo City industrial area of more than 100 square kilometers. Luo Li like this is still facing great danger to his life. What kind of scale will the incoming enemy be? This is definitely the most difficult job transfer task. Luo Li really didn't expect that he would have the unlucky day to get a hell level job transfer task. This is much less likely to occur than the simple job transfer task that can be passed as soon as a letter is drawn. Boom. Luo Li was not given more reaction time. At this time, there was a loud noise outside. The entire workshop shook violently as if it had been hit by an earthquake. That arrived so fast. Feeling tense, Luo Li didn't dare to delay. He quickly put on his combat equipment, opened the door and rushed out. Two warriors in purple combat uniforms, obviously intruders, happened to be standing in the aisle outside. When they saw Luo Li who opened the door, they shot at Luo Li with the submachine gun in their hands without saying a word. Luo Li subconsciously rolled sideways to avoid shooting. Then activate the power arm, the left arm brought a piercing sonic boom and punched an approaching intruder. There was a crisp bone cracking sound from the other party's body, and the whole body bowed into a ball, carrying terrible power, and smashed backwards towards the companion behind him. System prompt, kill the intruder x2, gain plus 8 experience points. System prompt, you have received the bonus of the mechanical heart effect, and the experience value obtained has been changed to plus 80. Enemies can be encountered here. It seems that the entire machinery manufacturing workshop should have almost fallen. The place where Luo Li's workshop is located is located in the deepest part of the workshop. It is usually the most closely supervised area. The intruder's arrival here also means that the workshop's defense system has completely fallen. Leave this building first. With his eyes fixed slightly, Luo Li held his rare quality assault rifle in his right hand and kept the power arm activated in his left hand and quickly kicked open the safety fire door at the end of the aisle. Boom. There was another loud explosion. This time the explosion apparently occurred under the building where Luo Li was located. The entire 17-story complex tilted slightly and then collapsed. Luo Li, who just ran to the escape stairs, inevitably fell down with the floor. It cannot be buried. Luo Li, who was falling, made a quick decision. The surging power from the light power arm swept through the whole body, smashing the nearby concrete wall with one foot, and the whole person broke through the nearby window with the momentum. People are in the middle of the sky. Luo Li rolled several times in a row, shedding most of the momentum, and finally landed safely in the green belt downstairs. The situation outside is not as bad as Luo Li imagined. In the square and other buildings inside the workshop, 
there are still many security personnel fighting the intruders. Not a one-sided route. Quickly see the pattern in the field. Luo Li shot down several nearby intruders with his assault rifle. Relying on his familiarity with the terrain, he successfully avoided other people and hid behind a warehouse. The attack came too suddenly without additional magazines. Only 12 rounds of ammunition left on the assault rifle. The ammunition of the scout drone is full, but the pistol bullets are useless. After counting his ammunition, Luo Li was a little helpless. Judging from the intruders encountered so far, they are all soldiers wearing ordinary body armor and receiving military training. It is difficult for the firepower of drones to pose a threat to them. Next, his main fighting method is estimated to be close combat with a light power arm. Think about it. Did not rush out of the hiding place. Luo Li manipulated the reconnaissance drone and rose into the sky. The territory of the entire industrial zone is gradually being brought into the drone's field of vision. Then the screen went black, and the connection between Luo Li and the drone was cut off instantly. It was destroyed, and the opponent has anti-aircraft weapons. His face sank slightly, and Luo Li's mood was a little dignified. Ordinary mobs would not have such tight air defenses. The invaders were likely a regular army. This means that he did not encounter a short-term riot, but was caught in a battlefield. Close your eyes. Luo Li carefully recalled the last picture transmitted by the drone. The place where the exchange of fire is most intense is the Magnetic Fluid Research Institute in the east, and the Precision Chip Manufacturing Bureau in the northwest. If you want to leave the industrial zone nearby, you must pass through one of them. If you don't want to be affected, you have to choose another direction to break through. But in this way, the distance will be much longer, and the danger will not be small. After thinking for a while, Luo Li decided to take a detour. An important place like the Research Institute must be the main target of the intruders. The chances of a strong one appearing are very high. Luo Li is just an ordinary life employee who is paid in exchange for pieces. There is no need to forcefully go over to join in the fun. The point is that there is no benefit yet. The main task now is to complete the job transfer. Take a deep breath. The architectural layout of the industrial area came to mind. Luo Li drove the light power arm, sank his palm into the wall behind him, and jumped over the wall with a light leap. Along the way. With the addition of the power arm, Luo Li easily solved several waves of intruder teams who met each other. Turning the corner into an alley, Luo Li stopped suddenly. With a vigilant expression, he raised his power arm to block in front of him. Ten meters away in front of him, the wall cracked without warning. A metal scorpion with a length of three to four meters appeared in his field of vision. Found the mechanic. Wipe out. The metal scorpion's eyes flashed red, and after locking onto Luo Li, it jumped up high and rushed towards him condescendingly. Extreme explosion. With no time to dodge, Luo Li decisively used the skills attached to the mechanical power arm. The silver mechanical arm instantly produced a huge sonic boom, carrying a dazzling streamer, facing the attack of the metal scorpion head-on. Boom. There was a muffled hum in the air. The metal scorpion weighing several tons was smashed to the ground by Luo Li's fist, and electric arcs ran wildly on its body. The enemy threat is extremely high. Turn on high energy rays. A deep red light group gradually gathered on the metal scorpion's tail. An astonishing amount of heat spread out from it, scorching like the scorching sun at noon. Can't let it launch. The premonition of danger in my heart was full. Luo Li's body was tense, and he ran straight behind the metal scorpion like a cheetah. Recklessly driving the power arm, blasting towards the core position of the red light group. The red light cluster expanded, and the temperature abruptly rose to 6,000 degrees Celsius just before Luo Li approached. However, the temperature close to the surface of a star cannot resist the sudden advance of the mechanical power arm at all. Click. Accompanied by the slight sound of glass shattering coming from the red light cluster, the entire light cluster disintegrated in an instant. The inside of the collapsing light cluster lost the huge power of the carrier and turned into a dazzling arc in an instant, starting with the metal scorpion tail, 
piercing through its entire body. System prompt, the light mechanical power arm has been violently shaken, and its durability is minus 4. System prompt, kill the 26th level mechanical creation metal scorpion, experience value, plus 325. System prompt, you have received the bonus of the mechanical heart effect, and the experience value obtained has been changed to plus 3250. Thank you for watching Mystic Realms Recap. Please like share and subscribe. Have a great day.